नमस्ते वेलकम टू ब्लिशॉन कॉन्सेप्ट टीचिंग लेट्स डू द कंस्ट्रक्शन यूजिंग रूलर एंड कंपास ओनली हियर दे हैव गिवन द इंस्ट्रक्शन दैट वी हैव टू यूज ओनली रूलर एंड कंपास फॉर कंस्ट्रक्शन कंस्ट्रक्ट अ ट्रायंगल ए बी सी इन विच बी सी इज इक्वल टू फोर सेंटीमीटर एंगल ए सी बी इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री एंड द परपेंडिकुलर फ्रॉम ए ऑन बी सी इज टू पॉइंट फाइव सेंटीमीटर ड्रॉ द सर्कम सर्कल ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए बी सी एंड मेजर इट्स रेडियस फर्स्ट लेट एस ड्रॉ अ ट्राइंगल अकॉर्डिंग टू द गिवन मेजरमेंट सर बी सी इट इज फोर सेंटीमीटर मेजर फोर सेंटीमीटर बी सी इज फोर सेंटीमीटर से लेट मी ड्रॉ अ रफ डायग्राम हियर बी सी फोर सेंटीमीटर एंगल ए सी बी इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री इट मीन्स एंगल सी इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री टू कंस्ट्रक्ट फोर्टी फाइव डिग्री एट द पॉइंट सी लेट एस फॉलो दीज स्टेप्स ओके Let me produce this line. We have produced a line at C. Take the compass of any measurement and keep the compass on the point C. And draw an arc like this. You know that from here to here. this angle it measures 180 degree right if we take the angle bisector of 180 degree it will become 90 degree so let us take the angle bisector of this angle to do this keep the compass at this point and cut an arc keep the compass at this point and cut an arc now join this now let me show this perpendicular by the dotted line this one it measures 90 degree right from here to here it measures 90 degree if we take the angle bisector of this angle it will become 45 degree right to do this keep the compass at this point and cut an arc keep the compass at this point and cut an arc and join this so this is 45 degree we have constructed 45 degree at the point c now let us come to the question and the perpendicular from a on bc is 2.5 cm first let me explain the meaning of this we have constructed 45 degree at the point c right we have to mark a point a on this line such that if we draw a perpendicular line from the point a on bc then it should measure 2.5 cm let me explain this clearly see here if i mark this point on this line whether it measures 2.5 cm if i draw a perpendicular line no isn't it suppose if i mark this point then whether it measures 2.5 cm if i draw a perpendicular line on bc no isn't it then if i mark this point as a then it measures 
2.5 cm. Isn't it? See here. Then from this point, if I draw a perpendicular line on BC, then it measures 2.5 cm. That is the meaning of this question. Okay. It means we have to mark a point A on this line such that if we draw a perpendicular line from A on BC, then it should measure 2.5 centimeter it is the meaning of the question to mark the point a we have to follow the following steps okay first step is we have to produce a line on this side we have produced this line to draw a perpendicular on b okay now take the compass of any measurement Keep the compass on the point B. Then draw an angle. Now let us take the angle bisector of this. Keep the compass at this point and cut an arc. Keep the compass at this point and cut an arc. Now join this. Now measure 2.5 cm using the ruler. You can see that it measures 2.5 cm. Keep the compass on the point B and cut an arc on the perpendicular line. It measures 2.5 cm. Keep the compass on the point C and cut an arc on the perpendicular line. Now join these two points. Now let us name this parallel line as EF. The distance between these two lines is 2.5 cm. Now, see here, this 45 degree, this line intersects EF at this point. Let us name this point as A. Here. Now I will show this by using the ruler. Suppose if we draw a perpendicular line from the point A on BC. So it measures 2.5 cm. Isn't it? We have marked point A according to the instruction of the question. Right? Now join AB. Now, A, B, C is the required triangle. Did you understand up to here? Okay. Now, let us move on to the second part of the question. Draw the circumcircle of triangle A, B, C and measure its radius. We know that to draw a circumcircle to the triangle, we have to take the perpendicular bisector of any two sides. Let me take the perpendicular bisector of BC. To construct a perpendicular bisector for BC, we have to take more than half of BC. Right? So this is more than half of BC. Keep the compass on the point B and draw an arc. Keep the compass on the point C and cut an arc.
Now join this. Now let us take the perpendicular bisector of AB. We have to take more than half of AB. Keep the compass on the point B and draw an arc. Keep the compass on the point A and draw an arc. And join this. These two perpendicular bisectors, they meet at this point. Right? Let us name it as O. Taking OA as radius, draw a circle. Taking OA as radius, let us draw a circle. Measure the radius. OA is say 2 cm. OA is 2 cm. Hope you have understood. Thank you.